Hello and welcome to Rescue Speechless. Today's video is going to be another skin combo video and today's skins will be Kit. Let's get into this video and this video is going to be another skin combo video and today's skins could be Kit and this video was suggested by A underscore sev g underscore 1231 thank you very much for the video suggestion and they said can you do combos for kit from chapter 2 season 3 if you have him and the kit skin was from the chapter 2 season 3 bat pass thank you very much for the video suggestion and kit has three edit styles and he's a part of the mecha kitty set as you see here he has a default he has the happy kit which you unlocked happy kit for completing five challenges from week six and then the Everstar, which is Action Kit, which you got for completing 40 weekly challenges. So I made three combos for the Standard Default, three for Happy Kit, and then four for the Action Kit. Let's get into the first combo. So first combo, I thought I'd use the Backbrain, the Meow School's Genki, which is part of the Gujamon set, introduced in Chapter 2, Season 7's Back Pass. And this is the Gujamon skin's Backbrain. Works very nicely, because obviously it's basically like a toy version of Meow School's Pickaxe. Is the Fishbone Flayer, which is part of the Cali Cool set introduced in Chapter 3, Season 4's Battle Pass. And this is basically the goth version of the Meow School skin. I'll quickly show you the skin. I always forget this skin's name. Let me just quickly find it. It's Cali Cool. There we go. This one says Meow Skulls is pickaxe. Works very nicely for the white and goes very nicely for the stand air style for the kit skin. The glider for the first three combos is the Skelly Fish, which is part of the Swole Cat set, introduced in Chapter 2, Season 2, and it's Meow School's glider. I wasn't sure what one to use, so this one works nicely for the white. Contrail is the Drone Drop. Just used this, because I've never used it before, and it works nicely, got a little bit of white as well. Part of the Intrepid Scoundrel set, introduced in Chapter 4, Season 3, and the first weapon wrap is the Clico, which is part of the Swole Cat set, introduced in Chapter 2, Season 2's Battle Pass. And this Meow School's web map works very nicely with the standout style with the white and the brown. Let's move on to the second combo for the kit skin now. For this one, I thought I'd use a set of wings as you see with obviously the color of this edit style. He has white, he has brown, also has a little bit of black as well. So I decided to use a set of white wings. And the wings I'm using, which are my favorite ones, which are the perfect wings, introduced in Chapter 1, Season 9. A very nice Shadow Series back wing. But if you don't have this set of wings or don't want to use this set of white wings, use any other set of white wings you have would work nicely. Pickaxe is a Dune Scooper. Part of the Taste of the Paradise set, introduced in Chapter 4, Season 3's Battle Pass. And this is the um, par Paradise, the Paradise Meow Schools. Pickaxe works nicely with the standard edit style, which is a Dune Scooper. And then the Weapon Wrap is this one right here. I want to quickly load it. The Cali, the, the uh, Spinal Vinyl, which is part of the Cali Cool set, introduced in Chapter 3, Season 4's Battle Pass. And it's the Meow Skulls skins web wrap basically like the emo version of the meow score skin works very nicely for the black the white and the brown as well let's move on to the third combo now for this one i thought i'd use the paradise meow school's back ring which is this one here which is the cali the clico coconut part of the taste of the paradise set introduced in chapter four season three i'm using the standard ed style for basically the brown Pickaxe is the Solid Scratch, which is part of the Swole Cat set, introduced in Chapter 2, Season 2's Battle Pass. And this is Meow School's Pickaxe, mainly using it for the black, but it's a pretty cool pickaxe, dual wield knives, pretty cool. And then the weapon wrap is this one right here, which is the Regiment Gear, which is part of the Special Operations Squad set, introduced in Chapter 4, Season 2's Battle Pass. And this is Aaron Yeager's weapon wrap, which was the secret skin from that season. So it works very nicely for the white and the brown mainly. Let's move on to the next combo, which is now the second edit style for the kit skin. And this edit style is the happy kit. As I mentioned, you got it for completing five challenges from week six. The design is white and gold kit. And obviously on his actual mech himself, or itself has pink, has blue, has a little bit of yellow, white as well. Pretty cool design. Works very nicely and it's pretty cool edit style in general. And all the edit styles full of skin are pretty cool to be fair. The back bling for the first combo is the bright bag. Part of the sunshine and rainbow set. Introduced in chapter 1 season 3. Using this back bling it's got so many different, of the, it's got so many of the colours. It's got blue, it's got yellow, it's got pink. Pretty cool back bling. It's the bright bomber's back bling. Pretty cool back bling with the colour scheme. Pickaxe is a rainbow carver. Sim rainbow carver. Similar to the back bling. Has a lot of different colours. Has yellow, has pink. Has blue, part of the Undercover Summer set, introduced in Chapter 2, Season 7. The umbrella for the next three combos is a Rainbow Cloud Cruiser, which was introduced in Chapter 2, Season 7. Has pink, has yellow, works nicely. If you don't have this, use any other glider slash umbrella that has that colours 
could be yellow, it could be pink, it could be blue, it could be a mixture of all similar to this guy. We have a mixture of a few of the colours. Contrail, the next three combos, is a Rift Lightning, part of the Drift set in Season Chapter 1, Season X. It's back pass, using it for the pink. It's similar to the Glider, you can use any colours that are on the actual skins. It could be white, blue, pink, yellow, and so forth. And the weapon wrap for this combo is this one right here, which is the Rainbow Fog. Introduced in Chapter 2, Season 4. I really do like this weapon wrap a lot. Works very nicely with the set style. With all the other items in this combo, with all the different colours on the actual skin. This one has a lot of them. It's animated as well, which is always a bonus. Let's move on to the fifth combo now. For this one, I thought I'd use an Icon Series backplane. The one I'm using is Chica's Star, which is part of the Chica set. Introduced in Chapter 3, Season 2. I'm using a Royale Streak edit style, which has got yellow, it's got blue, it's got a little bit of pink as well. Pickaxe is the Star Wand, which is an item shop pickaxe part, or doesn't have a set. Introduced in Chapter 1, Season 8. I'm using it for the pink, the yellow, and the blue. And the weapon wrap for this combo is this one right here, which is Shuffly Shapes, which was introduced in Chapter 2, Season 5. It's animated and reactive. I'm pretty sure this is an item shop weapon wrap, but similar to the actual other items in this combo, I'm using it because it's got pink. It's got yellow, it's got blue, it's animated and reactive, which is always awesome. I'm not exactly sure how, not exactly sure how it's reactive, but obviously it's animated because it's moving, but I'm not too sure. Either way, works very nicely for this combo. Let's move on to the combo number six now. For this one, I thought I'd use, I'd use the Atom Eve emblem, which is part of the Guardians of the Globe set. Introduced in Chapter Fortnite OG, Season Fortnite OG. Works very nicely for the pink. You can use any backbling that's pink, a holographic, or just any pink backbling in general. I do like this one a lot. So I recently bought the Guardians of the Globe bundle, which came obviously Omni Man, Invincible, and Atom Eve. Pickaxe is the Kai Scythe, part of the Dragon Ball set, introduced in Chapter 4, Season 2. You can either use this one, Kai Scythe, or the Kai Sword. They're both Goku Black's pickaxes. You can use either one, it works nicely. If you don't have this, use anything pink themed for this combo, would work nicely. And the weapon wrap for this combo is this one right here. Which is a pink splatter, introduced in Chapter 1, Season 9, using it for the pink and the blue, or light blue. Let's move on to combo number 7, which is now the final edit style, which is the Action Kit. Which you got this for completing 40 weekly challenges. As you see here, it has a nice black and red design for the actual kit, with its actual, I guess you say, it's colour, its fur colour. Obviously black and then red eyes, and like a scar as well. And on his actual mech, he has a bit of black, green, a lot of different colours. But I mainly comboed with the red and the black, to be fair. The back bling is a black shield. Introduced in Chapter 1, Season 2's Bat Pass, part of the Fortnite set. And it's a black knight's back bling. He was a tier 70 skin, which is the max tier you could get in that season. And if you don't have this, you can always use a red shield as an alternative. For the, for the red and the black would also work nicely. Or the Spectra Slasher. Not the Spectra Slasher, so the Spectra. The shield basically Spectre Knight's back bling, the shield from the old Fortnite OG Battle Pass, and design it like red and black or black and red would work nicely. Pickaxe is the, is the Muromasa Blade, part of the Zero War set, introduced in Chapter 3, Season 3, and it's Wolverine Zero's back bling slash pickaxe. For this combo, I'm using it for the pickaxe, the red and the black, or the black and the red, either way, obviously, it has both. And it was a crew pack skin, so if you don't have the Wolverine Zero skin, you can use any other pickaxe that you have that's black and red, or could just be fully black or red would work nicely. But this is one I decided to use sword wise. And then the glider for this combo, or umbrella I should say, is the mighty Marvel Brella, which has a victory art. Umbrella from Chapter 2, Season 4 Battle Pass, which was a fully Marvel season. And I'm using it for the red and the black. So if you don't have this, you can use any other glider slash umbrellas so that are red and black themed. Will work perfectly for these combos. Contrail is Rockfall from the Chapter 4, Season 3 Battle Pass, part of the Relentless Relic set. And this is relic. This is relics weapon. I'm not weapon. Contrail. <laughs> and see, it works nicely. It has a little bit of black and a little bit of red as well. I've never used it, so I thought why not? Because nicely for this edit style. The weapon wrap for this combo is a Star Wars series weapon wrap, which is Darth Shader, part of the Darth Vader set. Introduced in Chapter Three, Season Three, using for the black and the red. Let's move on to the next combo. It's now combo number eight for the kit skin. For this one, I thought I'd use a Star Wars series back bling. The one I'm using is the Sith Trooper Blaster, part of the new trilogy set. Introduced in Chapter 2, Season 1. Using it for the black and the red. Pickaxe is the Axo, which is part of the weekend set. Introduced in Chapter 5, Season 1. Using it mainly for the black. And this is a combat weekend's pickaxe. Works very nicely. I do like this one a lot, especially for the black for this combo. The weapon wrap for this combo is this one right here, which is from this season, Chapter 5, Season 1, which is Valeria's weapon wrap, or one of the four weapon wraps she has, which is the Burn, part of the Flame and Fortune set, using it for the red and the black. 
Let's move on to the next combo. The second last combo for the kit skin. First one, I thought I'd use a cape back bring. The one I decided to use is the Omni Man's cape. Part of the Guardians of the Globe set. Introduced in Chapter Fortnite OG, Season Fortnite OG. Using this for the red, but you can use any cape that's red or black themed. Or if you want to use the Emoti cape, which is the one that comes with these customized on superhero skins and have it black and red, would work nicely as well. But this is the one I decided to use. Pickaxe is a Foundation's Plasma Spike. Part of the Seven set. Introduced in Chapter 3, Season 1's Back Pass. This is Foundation's Pickaxe, who was the secret skin from Chapter 3, Season 1. The star I'm using is Foundation's Plasma Picks for the dual wield. And the color is Foundation's Flame, basically for the black outline, for the red and the black. Obviously, the outlines you can see here, if you put the standard, just doesn't have the black outline. So that's why I'm using it. Works nice if you can also use a single wield, which would just be the standard spike instead of the picks. And then the final weapon wrap is this one right here. Or the sorry, yeah, second last final weapon wrap is the Blasted, which is part of the short fuse set in season chapter 2, season 2's Battle Pass, and his TNT's weapon wrap from that season, using it for the red and the black. And let's go on to the final kit skin combos now. For this one, I thought I'd use Meow Skull's Back Bling, which is a feline fun part of the Swallowcat set in season chapter 2, season 2. I'm using the Shadow Edit Style for the black. Pickaxe is the Vision, which is an Iron Drop Pickaxe, part of the Ouroboros set in season chapter 1, season 7, using this for the black. And the final. Weapon Wrap is a fully blacked out Weapon Wrap, which is an item shop, which is stealth black. Part of the Air Royale set in Season Chapter 1, Season 8. So that's all of the kit skin combos done. Thank you once again, A underscore Sav G underscore 1231 for the video suggestion. Kit is a very unique skin and has three good edit, three edit styles to be fair. And if there is any other video suggestions you'd like to see, for example, could be cosmetic skin, backlink pickaxe, glider slash umbrella, contrail or weapon wrap or anything other Fortnite related, well, sort of always feel free to leave them in the comments down below. I'm always down to give something new a go. But anyways, that was pretty decent.